surely the executive board, do they meet, do they, to determine what flag is oh, to well, be flown in the, the morning? The, ex the executive board does meet um, very regularly on a range of issues. Uh, I can't say that I can recall the uh, any sort of flag issues ever being raised at the board, uh, but no. uh, as so would be the normal arrangement, we, we meet uh, fortnightly. Yeah, and so I can say that nobody has ever raised any flag issues with me, um, so I'm not aware of any flag issues. So if there is any concern in relation to flag issues, it might have been useful for that to have been raised. Well, the uh, yeah, uh, member of the finance staff that uh, has raised it with me is concerned because they uh, imagined that it would not be the minister that would make that determination, but possibly the head of department or somebody else within the department mm -hmm. as to uh, what flag. And look, uh, to cut to the chase, um, there was the uh, rainbow flag on display in the lobby, which, uh, believe it or not, some people see as an activist flag for a particular cause in relation to an issue of uh, whether or not we should um, change mm -hmm. the legislation on marriage. And uh, some people, of course, support that cause, others don't. But uh, I was just wondering what the protocol was uh, within mm -hmm. the Department of Finance, because uh, if that is allowed, then one imagines the Marriage Alliance banner should be flown equally. Uh, oh, I'm sorry. Um, you didn't say anything, no, I know you didn't say anything, but I saw the way that you reacted to that. Um, if you allow one side of a debate, then you need to allow the other side, and that is why I sought to determine up front who was responsible for making these determinations, and it looks as though we don't have anyone. Um, so can you take on notice who is actually responsible, with whom does the buck stop, who makes the actual decision as to what flags are flown? So, for example, when the Israeli Prime Minister was in town, uh, I understand we didn't see the need to fly the Israeli flag in the foyer of um, the, uh, the finance department. So who, who makes the determination as to what flags are exhibited or flown? Uh, in the foyer from time yeah. to time. Senator, I think I've already made the point that in terms of what's inside the foyer, that would be a matter for the executive board. Uh, and uh, I can certainly uh, raise this issue you know, within the executive board at its next uh, meeting, uh, and we can uh, discuss the way in which we'll manage well, this Well, if you the could future. then provide me with the copy of the relevant minutes of the executive board that made the determination in relation to the flying of this particular flag, that would be... Uh, um, very helpful. Thank you. I'll seek to do that, Senator. Thank you. And look, just for what it's worth, uh, by way of uh, some slight humour on this issue, this particular flag, you will realise, is uh, the flag of the gay and lesbian kingdom of the Coral Sea Islands that declared war on Australia. And you, uh, Senator Cormann, would uh, understand.